Hi, I'm going to show you how to update your firmware using the latest Shearwater desktop. This works for any Shearwater dive computer that uses Bluetooth, including the Petrol 1, the Petrol 2, the Nerd, and the Predator. I'm going to be using a Petrol 2 in this case, but it works for any of the other ones just the same. Now the first thing you want to do is install the latest version of Shearwater desktop. At the time of this recording, that's 2.4.0, and it's the earliest version that has this feature. You can get it from www.shearwater.com. I'm not going to go into exactly how to install Shearwater Desktop as we've covered that in an earlier video. So it used to be that in order to update your firmware, you had to go to our website and find the firmware for your dive computer, and download it, extract it, and then convince Shearwater Desktop to install it on your dive computer. That was a uh, laborious and an error-prone process, and so we changed the way that it works substantially. Instead, the way it works is you just have to go to Dive Computer, uh, Update Firmware, and Shearwater Desktop will start searching immediately for your Dive Computer. It has instructions on the screen that will show you how to put your Dive Computer into the Update Mode. And Shearwater Desktop uh, will find your Dive Computer and then inform you of what the latest versions for your dive computer are. Uh, at that point, you can also choose which language you'd like to use. Uh, so if uh, English isn't your first language, you can go ahead and, and choose any of the other ones that we have available. At this point, you can also view the release notes by clicking any of these uh, buttons to see what's changed. It'll open up in your default browser. So you select your language. In this case, I'm going to select English. And then you pick uh, Yes Update. Shearwater Desktop will download the firmware if it's not uh, finished yet, and then it will uh, start sending it to your dive computer. Uh, at this point, you can still uh, take a look at the firmware release notes, uh, or you can go and get a cup of coffee. It's probably going to take about five minutes to update your dive computer. Uh, I'm going to speed this up so you don't have to watch a progress bar going across the screen really slowly. So once the firmware has been sent to the dive computer, uh, you'll see please wait or some other uh, similar message on your Shearwater dive computer. The screen might go a little bit odd, uh, uh, depending on which version you have, uh, but that's okay. Just let it go. Now you'll note that it says uh, in big red letters, decompression tissues cleared, plan repetitive dives accordingly. Uh, but it also says update success, so we did it right. Uh, so that's all there is to it. Um, you, uh, you now have the opportunity to update another computer if you have another one, or a final, uh, a final opportunity to view the firmware release notes. And I guess that's it. All right. So uh, if you have any questions, just uh, send us an email at info at Thank you very much. Bye-bye.